Well, let's hope this works. Coming to you live uh, from somewhere in the middle of nowhere in the eastern panhandle of Florida, also known as Pelicamp, before a live audience. Hello, everybody, and happy Friday. I'm riding, 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 riding with my RV, my RV, wherever I want to be. Because I'm free in my RV. Well, I can see it buffering, uh, but it's probably going to stabilize in a few minutes. That's usually the way it works with uh, here at Pelican. By the way, today we have a, a campfire cam, a firing camp here. We have a nice campfire because it is cold out here. Well, not yet, but um, I mean, if you are from Minnesota, forget I said cold. It's going to be in the 30s tonight. It's going to be in the 20s tomorrow night. So um, I'm sorry if if you uh, see it buffering, but I'm I'm confident that it, this is gonna stabilize at some point, and uh, and yeah, we're gonna be about a minute behind, but it's all good. the The point is for us to be uh, you know hanging out here, sharing a moment, as as we usually do every Friday. Hello from Idaho, seven degrees. I wouldn't even know what that feels like. I've I've never been. Um, at a place with that temperature, uh, what can I tell you? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I, I was born in the Caribbean and lived in Florida all my life. Uh, hello, Robert. Looks chilly out there. It's it's. I mean, it's kind of uh, on the chilly side, as I, as I was saying. Uh, right now, it's probably in the 40s. Let me see if my my if my phone wants to work here, and I can give you a. Oh no, I'm calling Ely. Hold on. I I, I pressed the wrong icon. On my phone here. Oh, 59. My. 59? 59. It feels colder than 59. I'm sorry. Um, I, and there's not even wind. In in any case, the RV DJ, the bar is officially open. Thank you. And today we're having some big nose IPA from Swamp Head in Gainesville, Florida. And uh, we have a live audience here, of course. We have uh, Steve. Steve is having a Sam Adams. A New England IPA. See? Cheers. Cheers. And uh, our mighty moderator, this traveler, is somewhere back there. I'll keep this camera pointed that way because I think he went to look for some internet and uh, and I'm sure he'll be back. Um, first of all, I want to thank, I just got a super chat, but I want to thank Marjorie Hewitt for that super chat early, early before we started. And she says, please give a shout out to and happy birthday to Hayden for his eighth birthday. He's a big fan of yours. Thanks and happy birthday, dear Hayden. Happy birthday to you. And thank you, uh, Kyle A, for that super chat. Scariest place you've driven. Also, how do you control your road rage and suggestions for long drive fatigue? Thank you for everything. Well, when I drove in Miami... Every day in rush hour traffic through Little Havana, which is pretty much an, an, uh, an obstacle course at that time. Um, I did not control my road rage very much. It, uh, it was a very stressful experience, but now I'm like, uh, you know, I'm doing this for fun. So, and I'm, I'm never in, in as much of a hurry as I used to be. And uh, yeah, it's, I, you know, the long drives... Uh, I listen to audiobooks sometimes. I listen to podcasts. I listen to music. I, you know, have you ever been to South Dakota? Yes, I have. And I'm going back now as part of the summer road trip. Jason Bergeron seems to be stable now. Hey, Jason. Yeah, that's what happens with the, with the stream. With this, so I think it's this software that I'm using, um, which is Ecamm Live. When it detects the, uh, uh, you know, that the, the internet is very slow. Hold on, is, is, that, is that the Bigfoot back there? What? what who's that? <laughs> Are we safe here? That was... Uh, uh, hey, hey, miss, mister, sir, what are you doing here? No. We have a trespasser, what can I tell you? 
And I was saying something deep and profound, and I, now I forgot what it was. Oh, that this software, I think it just buffers locally, and it just sends the 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 signal as it. For for some reason, after a while, it works, and yeah, we are one mi we're one whole minute uh, behind. The, You're being attacked. I think yeah, I'm being attacked. Is, is that it's is that what's it called? Sas Saskawa what? Saskawa. Yeah. Saskawa. Who's that back there? Pick up a log, sir. Yeah, pick up a log and bring it to the to the uh, to the. Um... I thought you were carrying a blue range, not that thing. Who are you? This traveler, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the show. Hello from the Cardo family in Hialeah. Hialeah. Are you gonna bring that log to the fire? What What are you doing? Uh. Okay, I'll put this into your no, fire. That, that would not be a good idea. <laughs> Elizabeth... <laughs> <big bomb. laughs> Elizabeth Rubbler, thank you for that super chat, and a super sticker, and it's a lemon character doing something or another. I don't know. You're uh, not on top of stuff. No, no I'm not. Oh, it's a, it goes like this. I guess it's... it's <laughs> yeah, in the, in the real live stream now, is that you coming... What am I doing wrong here? I'm, I'm getting distracted by someone behind me here. Where are the moderators? <laughs> no, just kidding. Um. Do we did we get a super chat from El Mandalorian that I didn't see? What's going on here? Am I not on the? Dude, you're distracting me. What are you doing? <laughs> Saskawatch says Natalie Driscoll. Thank you very much. Airscape, Air, uh, Lisa, Lisa. She's, she's la laughing out loud uh, out there. And uh, Dangerous Banana from South Africa. All right. Hey, Mr. Dylan Reynolds, question. Are you planning to visit St. Louis, Missouri soon? I sure am. That's probably one of, you know, that's that's where the, the Lewis and Clark expedition finally took off after, uh, you know, many delays. And and uh, the, the guy who was building their ship was a drunk, so he wouldn't. Um, oh, really? Yeah, he was. So he would delay and delay and he wouldn't work. And uh, eventually, Lewis just, what was it? Yeah, it was Lewis. Clark was doing something else near Louisville. Uh, Lewis went there and uh, it was in Harper's Ferry that they were building it. And he went there and, you know, he was on top of the guy until they finally did it. Uh, yeah, I'm, re I'm reading a book, you know, in pre preparation for that trip. And uh, by the way, we have a campfire. Camp the fire is dying, by the way. The fire, that fire is dying. I don't know what's going on. It's supposed to get uh, cold in Florida tonight. Keep warm. Yeah, and tomorrow night is going to be in the 20s, according to what I read. Uh, I was hoping to see, you know, Pelly Camp here, this uh, this uh, beautiful barren land covered in snow. Wouldn't that be something? You know, my, my beautiful pine tree up there covered in snow. I don't know. In any case, let me, let me put it back to... And I decided to start a little early today because... First, it's going to get uh, uh, um, cold, and then it gets it started. I mean, days are getting longer and longer, but it's still, it get, by, by 6 p.m., it's, it's kind of dark. So, um, in any case, uh, Todd Webb from Tucson, Arizona. So happy I found your channel a few months ago. Oh, thank you. Thank you for being here. The welcome to the club. Uh, hey, Sue. Yeah, that was this traveler behind me, Deborah Gomez. Love your videos. Thank you for your adventures. Apple and Rob says, L say LOL. Apple and Rob. I forgot to invite Apple and Rob. Where are they? They're, they're probably at the captain's hideaway. Just stone throw away. Eh, is that an echo I hear? Just a stone throw away from Pelicamp. Um, hello, Vish. So nice to see you. Uh, uh, when is your Lewis and Clark trip scheduled to begin? Also, are you planning to do a Las Vegas trip anytime in the future? Would love a 4K video of Vegas. I have been to Vegas a couple of times. I might be back on, uh, as part of this long trip. I don't know. 
for sure winter uh, 23 next winter for sure and at some point i want to go to area 51 at least to, up to that fence where they tell you not trespassing and uh, and if you do uh, we'll hide this traveler for five minutes hold on I'm going here. Uh, hey, Paul, thank you for the super chat. Have you thought about using Starlink? Hi from 305. I, I already pre-ordered Starlink. Um, he's just taking his sweet time. You know, my buddy Elon, uh, he needs to launch more satellites and, and uh, forever uh, destroy uh, ground-based astronomy. Which uh, Apparently, all the astronomers are, are, are getting mad because of all the blurriness that all these satellites are going to produce, oh. you know. All the garbage up there. At least we have that new telescope. What's it called? The one they just launched. Uh, you probably know that. The one that is... Uh, it's, it's like, there, here's the sun, and here's the earth, and the telescope. They put it on the dark side of the... Yeah, it's... I forget the name of that exact... Uh, uh, thank you, Paul Kazanis, for that super chat. And video game control jumps up and down, up and down excite, excitedly. That's a super sticker. Actually, I'm sorry. Um, hey, Carl Comrie Crumley, if you stay warm, I'd rather be there, even though it's cold at Pelican Camp here in upstate New York. It's going to be nine tonight. Oh, be careful with the cold there up there. Your name here. Thank you for that super chat. Happy Friday, Robert from Phoenix, Arizona. Uh, you've got uh, great pipes. Who's your favorite musician? Throw another log on that fire. Well, yeah, I have assistants here and uh, and uh, Steve, and I got all the ashes on top of the computer. Hold on. I should bring out the, the, the blower. Steve there is stoking the fire. Uh, so, yep. Uh, I have another super chat somewhere down here before. I... Uh, Hey, Jay Han, thank you for that super chat. How did you enjoy the Tampa RV show? Thanks for all you do. No, you're welcome, Tampa. Dude, you're distracting me. Uh, Tampa RV show was exciting, was uh, exhausting, actually. Um, and for, for the first time in a while, actually, uh, for a couple of years, it had been kind of stagnant in the sense of innovation and all that. But this year, you know, they, they came out with all the, all the bye lithium bye. batteries. Bye-bye. 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 You're leaving for, for... No, you're not leaving, are you? Yeah, I'm going to be leaving, yeah. Oh, okay. Bye. Yeah, this this has a, a, a four-hour drive uh, coming up ahead because... Just to be on this show. Oh, man. Well, thank you for coming this. Mm -hmm. now, now you know where Pelicamp is, if you want to... Yeah. yeah, it's right here. Right here. Yeah, don't drop, <laughs> the, the, drop those GPS coordinates and... Uh, and we. <laughs> at, at some point, I want to do a Pelicamp Fest. Somewhere, sometime in the future, you know, one of these days. So, um, we were talking about the Tampa RV show and uh, my journal. Hi, Robert. It was a pleasure meeting you today. Um, oh, yeah. You, uh, I met you at the, at the KOA, right? Well, it was a pleasure meeting you too. I went to the KOA to get oh, some, yeah. some propane because we're going to need it tonight. And, uh, yeah. Bye, Diz. Yeah. This, this traveler, uh, James uh, Hay, uh, from Haymarket, uh, Virginia. Hi, Robert, following you since 2017. Thank, thanks you for, thank you for all you do. No, thank you for following me. 2017, that was the year I started uh, uh, YouTubing full-time. Buy this. Drive safe. Stay hydrated. Uh, Judy Smiley says, Steve seems really happy. Steve, are you happy? I'm very happy. There you go. <laughs> there you go. From now on, it's going to be happy, Steve. Okay, no, never mind. Okay. Um, oh, we have from Greece. Hello, Calimera. Greetings, Robert, from Thessalon Hold on. Thessaloniki, Greece. Thank you, Greece. Where it is uh, 11 p.m. right now, or maybe it's midnight. I don't know. Is 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 Greece in the, in European Central Time or in the next one uh, coming up next? I don't know. In any case, uh, I want. I'm, I really want to go to Greece. I love Greek food. And uh, let me let me turn on the hold on the other camera here so you can see. 
Lock the gates on your way out. No, just kidding. This traveler, he just came for the beginning of the live stream. Um, and now he's gone. Oh, no. The dude in flannel stalking Robert. He seems to be... Huh? Well, <laughs> never mind. Uh, greetings from Istanbul, Turkey. You're my hero, Robert. Thank you, Istanbul, Turkey. We have a very international uh, uh, audience today. I guess since we started early, we're getting a little more of the of the of the European and the and the Asian crowd, which is cool. What time is it over there? Twelve hours. Istanbul's gotta be midnight. Should I ask uh, the Google lady? What is the time in Istanbul? Turkey. Just a moment. The internet is very slow here. Luckily, this phone is on a different network, so it shouldn't be affected. She'll she'll be back momentarily. Your or your call. The time in Istanbul, Turkey, is one o one a.m. on Saturday. One o one a.m. on Saturday. You're coming from the future. Well, she's coming from. She's coming from uh, from our uh, very nice uh, uh, outdoors bakers here. A uh, dangerous banana, Robert. Your show is awesome. It's like therapy for me. Well, I'm glad you like it. And uh, hey, hello, Robert. Will you please say happy birthday to our son, Alex? He loves your music. Happy birthday, dear Alex. Happy birthday to you. And Gene Aragon, my husband's name is Steve. There you go. Jackalope. Uh, he'll never forget this one. I'm getting some laughs here, fun times. From Newcastle, New England. That Wingham Oasis 540 from the RV show is so cool. I agree. It's like a micro mini and a van had a baby. Yeah, kind of is. Let me tell you, I, I really liked it. I really liked it. And uh, oh man, greetings for Robert from New Brunswick. Summer is here, 39 Celsius yesterday. Uh, how much is negative 39 Celsius in Fahrenheit? Um, but that's cold. I know that's cold. Is it minus 40 where they both meet and it's the same? I think so. Minus 39 degrees Celsius is equivalent to minus 38.2 degrees yeah, Fahrenheit. Yeah, ne negative 40 is uh, where they're both the same. It, it's darn cold, no, no matter which uh, metric system or, <laughs> or imperial system you use. Naim Tarar, hello from Pakistan. Pakistan, where it is morning. Stay blessed. The best wishes for you. Thanks for the amazing travel videos. Thank you so much. Thanks to you. If it wasn't for you, you know, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't be uh, here doing this. Uh, what I really like. It's snowing in Tennessee. Oh, it is. No, we, we're going to Tennessee soon. Hopefully, we have to monitor the weather. Make sure we don't get caught up in a. Did he take the pelican? I think he took the pelican. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> and we have uh, here a very a, 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 a personalized super chat. Su super chat from Steve Lloyd. Thank you so much. <laughs> can, I, can I do it like in person? Like, thank you for that super chat. You're yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's very cool. All right. Uh, yeah, whenever I do that, I lose the control of my cameras for some reason. Uh, uh, thanks uh, to you and Ely for your hospitality and all you do. No, you're welcome. You're welcome, man. Uh, tap channel. I'm I'm learning how to fly a drone. We were just flying the drone here earlier because uh, on days like today, there's no sun, so it's it's like the perfect weather to to get like an aerial shot. You don't get shadows or anything like that, so it's easier to discern. You know, to really pinpoint every detail. And uh, that's that's what I did today. I think Rob and Apple may be here. Rob and Apple are here. Yeah. Looks like maybe. Oh, and Alex. Oh, you gotta give me some of those. Alex got the last keg of Pelican Head IPA. He, he he's there at uh, at. Um, at Lost City Brewing Company, he was having a, a Pelican Head IPA, and apparently it was the last one. So, in any case, has, has anybody seen my mom? I did send her a text that we were doing this early today. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, someone just said, your videos are like therapy. I completely agree. I have watched them on repeat while going through a really rough patch. Got me saying, well, I'm glad. Um, that's for sure. Yeah, that's, that's Apple and Rob right there. Right. Yeah. I agree. Your videos are. They're wonderful. Well, thank you. You know, um, I have a good time making them. And, uh, yeah, I know it's going to get chilly in Florida this weekend. And, uh. Let's switch cameras here, so you know it's this is like high production television here. Look at that, <laughs> uh, Karen Haynes. Yay! I make another live. Yeah, yay! <laughs> and uh, Olive DeVries. Hi, Lucky Dog. Happy Friday, everyone. Uh, Airscape. Uh, Lisa, Lisa. Tiger, Tiger. Hi, Robert. Hi. Uh, traveling, Robert. Uh, no beer this weekend. Yes, we're having some. Uh, Coincidentally, oh, that's, we don't allow trucks that big here in the property. <laughs> Hold on, I have too many windows open here. Yeah, well, today we're having, you know, um, that's Apple right there, uh, disembarking from, from the Apple and Rob mobile, and that's Rob. We heard there was an intruder, so we came, you know. No, the, look, 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 who's oh, the intruder. <laughs> that's the intruder right there. I tried not to. <laughs> We brought, we come bearing gifts. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, look at that. I'm getting ashes on my machine. Thank you so much, You're Apple. You're welcome. You're getting some, uh, so when, I, when I'm done with my, with my big nose, I'm going to have a high ally, which uh, last week, uh, I went to the, to the brewery there. Oh, yeah. Did you? Guys, you have, you have to go there, like in person. It tastes so much better. Oh, yeah. We did. There. Have you tried their, uh, that burger with the uh, chorizo meat in it. Yeah, the frita. Oh. Yeah, that's uh, Ili had it. Ili had one. Wasn't it good? Yeah, I the chicharrones were my free from my my favorite. Through. Cigar City. They're in Tampa. And oh, yeah. come, Kate. Come say hello. I tried to keep her out. I'm sorry. Kate, come say hello. That's that's our. Yeah. She's like, oh, she must be crazy. Yeah. I was gonna bring Captain too. <laughs> there you go. So. um why can't I switch cameras here? Okay, let me let me let me pay attention to the chat here a little bit. So as, 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 as Tap Channel was saying, no beer this weekend. Yeah, we have plenty of beer here at uh, Pelicamp, uh, Axe Med AC. Robert, you always made my Friday a CLT a score. I just got the last keg of Pelican Head IPA. Woohoo! And now, now, how much would you would you pay? How much would you pay for a last keg of Pelican Head oh, IPA? <laughs> Where's everyone's favorite girl, Illy? Illy is monitoring the chat from the from you know from inside. We might convince her to come out. Yeah, come out, Illy. El Mandalorian traveler should plan a comedy sketch. <laughs> yeah. Uh, for sure, can 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 Nola build? Uh, thank you for the super chat. Hi from Nola. Well, Nola, uh, we're gonna be very close to Nola. Let's just not, not saying, just saying. But I don't know if we're gonna make it to to the to the Big Easy on this particular trip. We might stick to like more rural Louisiana. Oh, that that's a raging fire now. Look at that. Yeah. It's getting there. Those those logs that Apple and Rob brought. Yeah, they're custom rods. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, we just watched your entire Alaska trip on Wednesday evening, Dalton Highway. Yeah, that was a long time ago. That was 2010. I can't believe it's been 12 years. And on 2020, I was going to do, like, the 10th anniversary trip, and we all know what happened. So um, we might have to do the, the 13th anniversary or something. Uh, and uh, uh, Dylan says that tonight is going to be minus 33 with windshield in, uh, that's in the Toronto area. Uh, Rob, Bob Lee's tractor supply had LP patio heaters on sale for 99 What a sweet deal. Uh, what's going on there? Look at that. <laughs> that, that, might, that might be uh, Jason Bergeron says hello, Apple and Rob. Jason, you remember hi. Jason, the pilot? Oh, yeah. oh yes, hi. And uh, Robert, will we see a truck upgrade? I don't know if I should talk about it, but most likely. Most likely. I mean, the Colorado is getting up there in miles for a for a for a V6 gas engine, and uh, I don't want to get stuck in in Monument Valley. It's not a bad place to get stuck at, or no, no, Valley of the Gods. That's what I mean. It's not a bad place to get stuck, but I don't think they have AAA out there. 
Or if they do, it's going to take two or three that days. <laughs> yeah, that would be an expensive tow yeah. out there by Mexican hat, uh, uh, Utah. Speaking of AAA, I'll talk, we'll talk about it later. The new rules are that you've got to pay up this distance. Well, you do. So, no, no, no free. Look at that. Look at this. You should adopt her. I want to. <laughs> I was going to bring my cat. Yeah. Hello, Robert. It was nice to see you and say a quick hello at Tampa. Sure. Will you be at the Jacksonville RV show? I definitely will be there. No, no. I think I have to limit it to two or three RV shows a year at the most. And uh, we're probably not going to do another one until... I don't even know if I'm going to do Hershey this year. Um, but we'll see. I want to I wanna do an RV show like somewhere else. I know there's a good one in Louisville... There used to be the Pomona, California. I think Pomona, California got canceled permanently. And if I ever make it to Europe, I want to go to Caravan Salon. That's in Dusseldorf, Germany. A Barb, our friends Barb and Jim. Well, I thought we would buy one from last week. One from last week? Did I, that, that, I'm missing uh, the context in this conversation, am I not? Um, oh, my! I, I think my mom is here. Hello, everybody. Say hello to my mom. Uh, I'm here. Hi, everyone. Your neighbors are arriving. Greetings. Lots of love. Thank you, Mom. Uh, Barbev, yes, we would have bought your Pelican Head IPA from your last week. Uh, Jackie Trujillo. Hi, Robert. It's freezing in Toronto, Canada. Well, it's going to be freezing here tonight, literally. I think it's going to be 31. It's already getting colder. You know, it can actually snow. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's, it's kind of cloudy. You know, you know, I mean, if there are clouds, there could be precipitation in theory. And in theory, there could be some, yeah. I think I might lose it if it actually snows. I would love it. It's, it you know, you'd be imagining all this. Right. By the way, Armando Correa, thank you for that. Soup! <coughs> <coughs> Is that smoke? Perchat! Happy Friday, Robin and Lilia. It was nice seeing you guys again at the RV show. It was great seeing you too, man. And uh, hope to see you again at the, on the next one. Uh, no oh, man. Seventy-two in San Diego. Seventy-two in San Diego, really. Thank you for rubbing it in. Hello, Robert. Happy Friday. Cheers from New Jersey. We're gearing up for a blizzard up here. You better watch out for falling iguana down there. That's what I heard. Yeah, someone said about the falling. You're, we don't have too many iguanas here. No, we don't even we don't even have pelicans. But we have we do have some. But don't. They don't die, yeah. but they'll just like. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's what they get. They get uh, uh, lethargic. Yeah. Reduced to Farak. Back in 2014, my band died just uh, the Chinaman hat in Utah. The tow would have been 2,000 to Moab. Wow. Yeah. Wow. yeah. Out there, yeah. From where? From Mexican hat. It says Chinaman hat, but I think he means Mexican, Mexican hat, hat. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but yeah, it's. I mean, hopefully you have a mechanic friend or someone who knows uh, how to fix things. And uh, JR Candy is thank you for the super chat. Germany in the house. Danke Shane. Uh, will Will you be in Dusseldorf? When will you be in Dusseldorf? You rock. Well, I was thinking the next if next year we we finally go back to Europe. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it in my comfort zone and and go to Spain maybe. Italy, France, but we might make it all the way to Dusseldorf. I, I've been to Dusseldorf before, and if I go to Dusseldorf, I'm going to have an Alt beer with you at the Altstadt. How about that? And, uh, and some brats and all that good stuff. Mm. Oh, that sounds good. But I do want to visit some family in Spain as well. Maybe, maybe look up my ancestors. So uh, I'm thinking rent uh, or rent an RV in Madrid and just do a little loop. But once you're in Europe, you know, it's not that close, but it's doable. If we do like a month, that would be perfect. And Olaf Ja says, your German is perfect. Thank you. No, it's not. I only know two words. Danke Shane and Flughafen. <laughs> <The airport>. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Where's the Flughafen? Well, that's what I was asking people. Yeah, because when I got lost in, in Dusseldorf. I only know a couple of cuss words, too. <laughs> No, I don't know. Well, there's there's the the there's the the U bound the U bound. That's the the subway, and the, there's another one. The S bound is the one that goes 
Oh, above ground, I think. And then an exit is ausfart, I think. Fart? Ausfart uh. or something? <laughs> Means exit? <laughs> Probably, yeah. Well, I, I remember I remember when I was uh, back when I was a kid, my dad had a big Telefunken uh, radio. And it was ein, aus, like on, off. Oh. I remember those two things. Uh, Christopher also celebrating 14 months of membership. Thank you for be being a chief pelican head. <laughs> Thank you, Christopher, from the great land of Sweden. Hello from John and Linda in Delaware. Just watch your video and the blizzard out, uh, outside. Well, I've only the, the closest thing I've seen to a blizzard was that one time... At band camp, no, at at the, uh, in the at Monarch near Monarch Pass, in the in the in the Rockies, yeah. in the town called uh, I I, um, I mistakenly called it Salida. I pronounce it like in Spanish. It's called it's pronounced Salida. Salida. Yeah, because Salida. Salida is exit in Spanish, basically. So uh, this is probably one of those uh, anglicized Spanish words from from yesteryear. Like angle. Yeah, I, 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 I call it English too, yeah. yeah. <laughs> In any case, Charles Green, thank you for that super chat. Robert, do you like uh, surf fishing? Catch your dinner, Sandy. I, you know, I, I, I'm st I still have never actually quite fished in my life. I, I'm, I'm in the right area to learn. So uh, we'll see. I'll, I'll, one of these days I'm going to buy me one of them things. Uh, rod. Uh, you just throw a hook in the water and they just bite. Yeah, they just bite, yeah. So this summer we're going to rent ourselves a boat and go out there and see what we catch other than a cold. Uh, dangerous banana, maybe put a bit of Southern Africa on the bucket list. It is awesome place and costs are low. I, I, I would love to, to visit Cape Town. I've heard great things. And uh, I don't know, actually I have been in Africa, but not quite. I've been to Ceuta, which is a Spanish enclave on the north coast of Africa. So does that count? Yeah. I don't know. It's about, I mean, I was in the continent, in the landmass. But I, I do want to visit South Africa. Absolutely. And uh, but, uh, but, uh, definitely. Uh, Faith Rada, my fly Pelican Fly t-shirt with Robert driving the Key West Bridge is hanging back up on the Ray Porsche. Mr. Year. Oh, Oliver, uh, wait for the chips shortage to end before trading in the Colorado. Yeah, uh, I was told that the new Silverados are coming out in about three months. So I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, that, that's... Like that's easier to find. Yeah, that too. Yeah, no. And Natalie Driscoll, I will be catering a wedding today, so it will be hot by the oven. Uh, Natalie Driscoll. One of these days, we're going to make it to, to your neck of the woods. Uh, Jeff Watkins wanted to say hi to Apple and Rob. Hi. <laughs> Apple just got a baby. Yeah. Okay. What can I tell you? Katie just loves her. I can't believe it. <laughs> she loves her. Yeah, I just got to leave this camera on instead. <laughs> I, I, I'm her mother-in-law. Her and my dog love each oh, other. Oh, wow. They love each other. Too bad you're fixed. Too bad you're fixed. Oh, we could start a new family there. Uh, where did you get that cool fire pit? That, that's tractor supply here in town. Actually, the average campers, our friends, the average campers were like the first ones to get it. Uh, like, you know, it has the yep. stars and all that. Uh, when I hear a joke, oh, you, you, you know, if you ask uh, Alexa for a joke, she'll tell you a joke. It's... Uh, But you can ask the, the Google lady for a joke, too. But I don't know if it's going to be a dirty joke, so I won't. Uh, watch out for SpaceX tonight. I don't know if we're kind of, if we're kind of far from, from the Cape. So it's a lot of clouds. So we're probably not going to see it. And um, we love the video with your mother. Hope she is well. Much love from Long Beach. Man, my mom, my mom is, 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 is watching. So and, and uh, commenting, hey, Jose Sanchez. Desde Ackworth, California, Jose, vamos a visitar pronto. Uh, we're going to be visiting soon our, our, our family there in Ackworth, Georgia. So <coughs> it's a smoke from that cool looking fire pit. Uh, uh, 
my wife and I, hum your songs in our home, Oregon. Catchy melodies. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, hey, Rob, I've been watching your old salsa band videos. Do you keep contact with any of the guys and would you consider doing a mini tiny lounge with them? I, I am in touch with most of them, actually. Uh, and we could definitely call it a... Back in the day, we used to call it a ventu. It's in Spanish for... A what? Ventu. It means you come, you come, you come in Spanish. So, ventu, 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 ventu. Like you come, you come, you come. You, 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 we, we assemble a band with, with no rehearsal, no nothing. We just go to the place and play. Jamming. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Cool. Yeah, so that that's... Uh, we could do a ventu if you want. But, uh, yeah, I'm in touch with Chuchi. He's actually back in Miami. He was, he was living in... Um, in, uh, in Detroit for a while with his son, uh, and uh, of course Roberto Gomez, uh, uh, he's in my, he's back in Miami. He's his, he commutes back and forth between uh, Waynesville, and he's the band leader between Waynesville, North Carolina, and Miami, and everybody else. We, we we should do something like that one of these days. It might be like herding cats, you know, finding everybody, but we could do it. <laughs> we could do it. Uh, Carl Crumley, hi to Rob and Apple from a neighbor Carl. So say hello to Apple and Rob there. Um, doo -doo -doo. Barb, we are in South Carolina heading to Florida, bringing more cold weather. Well, try to outrun those storms, Barb. No, there are no storms coming from North Carolina. Uh, don't bring them with you, though. Yeah, I know. No. I mean, I wouldn't mind a little bit of cold weather. Uh, you know, we have to test those, uh, that furnace and all that stuff. <laughs> right. A little bit of snow would be cool. Actually, if you look that way, let me, let me, let me point the camera that way, a little, a little up. And if you look that way, doesn't it look very much like winter? That great, that gray sky. It's almost a black and white picture if it wasn't for Steve in the foreground. Oh. <laughs> It's like a black and white picture. Look at that. It looks very much like. It's so quiet today, too. Oh, it is, no yeah. Wind. No wind, no nothing. And Rob got a grand design uh, hat. Did they give you that hat? Uh, I, yeah, I got it at the <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we were all at the Tampa RV show last week. So, uh, James Duggan, I'm late to the party, but I was hoping you had your... Heated water hose for the cold weather. No, what I'm going to do tonight, I'm going to, you know, turn off the water. We have full tanks, you know, and uh, and tomorrow by 10 a.m. when it thaws, you know, I'm just going to turn everything back up. Oh, look who's here. Domo arigato, Mr. Roboto. Domo, domo. <laughs> Hello, Traveling rubber. We're getting ready for the big snowstorm in New Hampshire. Stay warm up there. It's, I'm sure it's going to be a lot colder than here, but... New Hampshire. It, New Hampshire. But here, they, they, they want us, they're going to f falling off the, tre the trees, that's what they say. They're falling iguanas. Snow squirrels in Kentucky. Oh, wow. Here. You know what is bad, though? When it freezes like this, sometimes it ruins the, the orange crops. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that's, true. that's the one real danger of getting a deep freeze like we're going to get tomorrow night. Uh, it's the coldest thing Brim Azul, Brim Bimmer. Oh, Spanian. Un saludo desde Madrid, España. We are waiting for you here. Grab a good IPA together. Absolutely, yeah, from Madrid, Spain. In Madrid, we, we will grab a caña, right? Caña, that's what we, that's the beer of choice. A bar bath, uh, now we want warm weather. We're stuck in frigid, smelly Michigan. Go box for today's. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why uh, Ohio people don't like Michigan people. Michigan people don't like Ohio people. I don't know like what's going on with that. Washington people don't like New Yorkers. It's there you go. <laughs> it's sports. Yeah, yeah, mostly sports. I'm sure it's uh, it's that uh, friendly. Uh, in K Kentucky, there's a big rivalry too between the, the University of Kentucky and the other guys, whatever name. They are. Uh, Betty Barker, my son Mitch, lives in Way Wickworth, Georgia. I'm sure we make Ackworth, Georgia. The W is very close to the A. So Ackworth, Georgia. His wife is from Ecuador. You look up for me. Well, Ackworth is a big, it's a pretty big place, believe it or not. But uh, yeah. Hey, hey, Colin Max Sherry. Hi, Robert. What's your favorite place you have ever lived? 
Well, I only lived in three places, really. Uh, Havana, Cuba, Madrid, Spain, and Miami, Florida. It's probably Miami, Florida. It's where I lived the longest. Well, you know, it's... Uh, in Cuba, I was a child and a teenager. In Madrid, I was a teenager. Very short time, so I didn't get the, get a chance to appreciate it all, all that much. So I would say Miami. Shirley Benoit, thank you for that super chat. Thank you so much. And Jason Bergeron is asking everybody to hit that thumbs up button and smash the bell, please. And uh, Charles Green, uh, Robert, could, um, how cold does it get at your new property winter-wise? Uh, well, this weekend, uh, this week is going to be about it. In the in the in the twenties, a, a quick overnight deep deep, uh, somewhat deep freeze, but a quick overnight freeze. By 10 a.m. is going to be above uh, above freezing. And that's pretty much as, as cold as it gets here. Yeah. Uh, in Miami, it's only frozen probably three times since I, since I lived there. Um, the time hi, Robert. The plug is not plugged in totally. What plug? What, what plug is not plugged in totally? And in my head, probably. <laughs> audio, that is. Audio. Um, I'm using the internal audio from the, from the computer. The internal uh, microphone, so should be all right. My my audio should be a little overmodulated, actually. I think I think it is overmodulated, but that's that gives me that AM radio sound. Darlene Barcelona, Fiona wants to say hi. She's going to Disney on Ice. Thank you for that super chat. Disney on Ice. I've never been to Disney on Ice. <clears throat> Eh, Luis Hernández, mi señora cumpleaños, Irene López. Un saludo desde Monterrey, México. So uh, his wife, uh, Irene López, it's her birthday. So happy birthday, feliz cumpleaños, Irene. Happy birthday to you. Uh, Paul Kizanis, if you're having problems with the audio, restart your phone. Ah, I'm on the computer. I'm, uh, I don't know. Does it sound like really bad? I don't know what I'm going to do with this, too. I'm telling you. <laughs> this Mr. Roboto says, sounds good to me. Oh, maybe it's on, on the other end that the, the problem is. Uh, Adam Johnson, we won't even buy gas in Michigan. Go Bucks. That's probably, it's probably more expensive to buy gas in Michigan. <laughs> uh, Giles Truchon, thank you for the super Chateauchon. And I see you have a picture of... Of Chateau Frontenac there at uh, Quebec City. Uh, it's cold here to, today, minus 20 in Quebec City, uh, Quebec. Uh, but I received a new free in my RV cup today. I'll be wearing it proudly. Thank you for your awesome videos from Quebec uh, City. Thank you so much. Thanks to you. Thank you um, uh, for. Uh, oh, darling is leaving. Hey, Kate. Oh, no, now she's gonna go. Um, she 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 heard something back there. Kate is our, our, our neighbor's pit bull, but she likes to hang out here for some reason. The place is going to the dogs, LOL. <laughs> Traveling Robert, audio is fine where I am in the world, and you are probably one of the farthest ones in the world. I mean, you are like, not quite down there, but you are like around down there. <laughs> so, yeah. Hey, Christopher, also no audio problems here. Sometimes the streams buffer, but not so much. Yeah, well, I mean, I'm here in the middle of nowhere. I'm, I'm, and uh, this is what, what ha John, John, John Milanowski, what happened to the pig? She's going to, uh, he or she, I don't know if it's a he. She, no. She's going to show up any any moment now. I heard her squealing yesterday. Yeah. I'm surprised she came all the way here because she lives like half a mile away, you know, that, that way. But... Uh, um, a lot of houses here don't have fences, so I guess she can go from place to place. Uh, she's going to be screwed when I finish the fence. But, uh, hey, Robert, sounds like a good party tonight and tomorrow. Yeah, it is going to be a good party here with a little bit of cold weather, but we're prepared. We have plenty of propane and firewood, so and beer, <laughs> just in case. It's like, what, what happens when, when there's a hurricane warning? You, you you go to Home Depot and buy some, some plywood, and then you go buy booze. Absolutely. And, and, you know. And you throw a hurricane party. That's the way we do it. 
this. By the way, I, I'm switching to highlight. Oh, this is delicious. Uh -huh. fresh. Yeah, it's very fresh. This is how we do it. Mm, do you have any plans for Valentine's Day? Um, well, we, Ailey and I, we're probably going to do a nice dinner or something together. There's, uh, there's nothing specific. We're probably going to be in Tennessee for Valentine's, which is going to be a probably a, a brisk uh, 25 degrees Fahrenheit. So, or it's snowing right now there. It's snowing right now. But we're going there in about two weeks, so... Mm. RC River, put a doggy door, yes, and I'll give her the password. Yeah, absolutely. I'll put a doggy door for, for Kate. Un lechón asado a la varita. Oh, that if, if, if roast pork. If, if, if uh, what, Sally shows up again. What's the pork? <laughs> yeah, roast. I don't know. That, that pig is kind of like someone's pet, so I, I don't, I, you know. I, I'm, I'm the new, yeah, on the spit. I'm kind of the new guy in the neighborhood. I don't want to, I don't want to eat the neighbor's pet. Just in case, you know. I'm sure she's delicious, but. Okay. Are there wild pigs in that area? I've heard there are. I, I know some people hunt them, so yeah. There are, I, I have seen one yet, though. Uh, okay, Ra deer. Rob. Rob has seen, and you've. I've seen deer. I've seen uh, uh, all kinds of wildlife. Like, but we have m m lots of chickens r roaming free. Like, we saw a chicken. But yeah, I I've seen uh, like tortoises. We've seen. Um, yeah. Uh, I've seen a couple of snakes. The the you know the black ones with this little head. I don't know. If those, those, those are, are probably, good. those are the good ones. So I've heard. No rattlesnakes or anything like that. So. Don't be a bum. Slam, slam, smash that thumb. Uh, Please to report my spice rack has been restocked in, in homage to uh, my heroes RV cooking show Cuban meatballs on the menu this week. Hey, where are you? I'll, I'll drive there. I'll bring the paprika. I'll bring the paprika. <laughs> Colin McSherrill, Robert, what's the worst thing you have ever eaten? My family had... Um, uh, you know what? I, I had Mexican food in uh, in Buellton, California once, and uh, that was pretty bad. Really? I'm surprised. Well, I don't know. Buellton yeah. would be a place for Mexican. Yeah, that's wine country, right? It's wine country. Oh. The hitching post for good steak. Oh, the hitching... The service was... She had an attitude for some reason, but the, the steak was amazing. The food was amazing, yeah. And the Pinot Noir, you don't have to, you have to, pay, have, if you watch that movie Sideways, you have to have a Pinot Noir, right? <laughs> and, they, and if they order Mer Merlot, I'm living. Right. <laughs> it totally went over my head, but... I'm sure uh, you, ha you haven't seen that movie yet. Yeah. Yeah, rent it, it's really good. <laughs> uh, the, v the VHS? <laughs> yeah, VHS. I think it was Betamax back then. No, it's, it's, it's from the late 90s, or it's like right. 2001, yeah. So I should yeah. go to Blockbuster and go pick up a tape. You know, Amazon Prime is a great thing. <laughs> I know it is. <laughs> <laughs> a Mandalorian. I will start planting some plantain trees for the mofongo. I don't know. Those, I don't know if plantains uh, will withstand uh, a freeze. No, it's a tropical place. Yeah, I don't think we could do. Uh, in Miami, we have plenty of planting. Uh, Robert, let me know if you, if I need to restock your paprika. No, I still have. You gave me that huge, huge thing. I still have it there. <laughs> No, we have plenty of paprika. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Uh, what part of Tennessee? Traveling Robert, because I live in Kingsport, Tennessee, and would love to do a meetup. Uh, this is what we're going to do. We're thinking the Natchez Trace Parkway, uh, just because I've, I've been hearing about that, that road forever. And I've, I've done a small segment, the, the part that crosses through Alabama, through northwestern Alabama. But I want to take the, the Natchez Trace from Natchez. I always take this, the, all these roads backwards. You're supposed to take the Natchez from Nashville to Natchez. You're supposed to route 66 from Chicago to LA. I'm I'm, I'm going to do LA to, LA to Chicago just to just to be a contrarian. And uh, and we're going to do the Natchez, and then we're going to look at some property. I, I don't know if you follow Mike and Jennifer the, the Wendlands. We're going to see if we like it or not. And if we like it, Pelicamp. Uh, what would be Tennessee? That's uh, it's near Linden. Yeah, near Linden, but what would you call it? Is that Dixie? No, that's really not Dixie. Dixie's more... Middle Tennessee. Middle Tennessee? Yeah. 
Yeah, but that doesn't have a nice ring to it. Oh. I have to come up with like... Um, oh, I can't think of anything. I mean, in Tennessee is, is a is music city, it's Nashville, and then... Also barbecue. Barbecue. We'll figure something out. Yeah. But uh, Pelicamp uh, Central, maybe, since uh, since Memphis is the is the hub for for FedEx, FedEx because it's kind of in the middle of the country. Uh, more 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 research shall go into this. <laughs> Pino is all the rage here in California right now, but I'll stick with my Zen. And do not say white Zinfandel no. because that's not wine. No, it's no, a not regular wine. red, you know, nice red Zin. It's it's really good. I love Blasphemy. Zin. Blasphemy. Uh, traveling, but from Jason Bergeron, traveling. Robert, let us know if you need a resupply on the salsa. We got two cases now. Yeah, I need a resupply. Of course, you know, I, I ordered on Amazon once, but that that uh, smoke point salsa is uh, is quite amazing. Tennessee equals Rocky Top. So we could call it Pelican Rocky Top. Uh, maybe not. There are no Pelicans in Tennessee. So. No. It's no. a Rocky Top camp. No. They could be. I don't know. Because there's there's Pelicans in the fresh water like in Northern California. Yeah. So maybe in the lakes or the rivers there could be Pelicans. And, and, and white Pelicans are, are snowbirds. Yeah. So, you know, at some point they have to cross That's through right. Tennessee. So, yeah. Pelican Rocket Top. We'll 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 put her in the in the in the in the short list Pelican top. of uh, Pelican Top of, of possible names. No, Colin Max Sherry. Uh, are there any new countries you would consider visiting? Oh, many many countries. Um, I'm not gonna be one of those guys like this uh, guy I follow on Instagram that has been to all 200 and whatever you know countries and territories. But I would love to visit some remote places eventually. Uh, I want to visit uh, at least every country in Europe, every country in South America, um, Whoa, some some fun. some countries in Africa, and some Southeast Asia. I would really, uh, really enjoy enjoy visiting. Mm -hmm. Machu, Picchu. Oh, yeah. Machu Picchu. That's uh, oh, Peru is in the short list of South American countries to visit for yeah. sure. Us too. Maybe we can like get a camper van in Colombia and just do the Pan American Highway or something like that. Uh, we're supposed to get over two feet of snow in southwestern Connecticut. Yeah, all you guys up north. And ha ha shoveling. If I was in Key West, I would totally rub it in because <laughs> Key West is probably going to get down to like 60 and everybody's going to freak out. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, though? We, we complain, but shoveled snow. And I would take 26 for one night, maybe two days out of the winter, then go back to Boston. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Okay, someone says Tennessee equals bourbon, but bourbon, bourbon is more Kentucky in my mind. But I just oh, thought of a name. Oh, you did? I just thought of a name. Drum roll. Ready? Belly Camp, Jack Daniels. There you go. <laughs> that is the true Tennessee, central Tennessee. <laughs> now we'll, we'll start bottling our own Pelican whiskey. Oh, no. Oh. Uh, Belly Camp, uh, what's that? So moonshine. Belly Camp oh, Moonshine. There you go. Uh, Steven San Filippo, I stayed at Gatlinburg Inn when, when Rocky Top was written. All right. Uh, we might be going to Gatlinburg soon, too. Just I thought there was someone there. It's just Kate. Okay. <laughs> Hello from St. Thomas, Ontario. Uh, you are making me jealous. I would like to have a fire, but it's too cold here. There you go. That's our... Maybe I should... No, it's. I don't have a wide enough angle to include Steve and, and the fire. So we'll 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 keep, the we'll keep it at the fire camp there, yeah. there. We should have a Kate camp. We should we should strap a GoPro to her. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Someone said moonshine too. There you go. And my mom, my mom. What is that? It's a, it's a that's emoji with the hands like that. Just like I give up with this one. Uh, yeah, Key West song to inspire those shove, shoving driveways. No. Yeah, I mean, Key West, uh, we, we are really uh, overdue for uh, a trip to Key West, that's for sure. I'm trying to do something here, but I can't. Why? Doesn't your sponsor have a, a new resort down there? Who? Your have a they're, they're building a huge resort in Isla Morada, oh. but they're going to have like bungalows, cabins, all kinds of like different things. Nice. That's uh, Sun Outdoors. Uh, which uh, 
which I'm going to visit now in Alabama and maybe in Gatlinburg and maybe, uh, you know, we're going to do like uh, every other uh, every other month a resort. I'm so tired. No, Pigeon Forge, not Gatlinburg. It's right next door. Uh, ask Remy. I'm so tired. Hello, Robert. Hey, Remy. How's it going? I was going to play something, but this uh, phone of mine, it's not cooperating. Ah, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we have an hour. Like. Lights. Yeah, once it gets darker, I can make the lights dance to the music too and all that. So, okay, just in case. <laughs> We're gonna add a DJ uh, aspect to our live streams now. Yeah. There's about three inches of snow. Oh, everybody's... It's, you guys are depressing me with the snow. There's about three inches of snow here and more falling. So Pelicamp looks pretty good. Yeah. Now she's got a stick in her mouth. That, that dog, man. That's this, this, She's hilarious. What's for dinner tonight? I don't know. We had some burgers as a late lunch. I was thinking of stopping by nowhere. But uh, we'll see. We'll see. I was thinking of that shrimp 308, oh, which uh, like if black and the chicken with a special sauce they make that it's like to die for. I hear they don't have karaoke anymore. No, no. not for the season. Not for the season. The season here is the summer. Which no is figure. Everybody's it, this is like not Florida. It's almost like we're in Georgia. It's, it's season in Florida is usually the winter. and uh, yeah. but, but in summer here, they have like uh, the, the scalloping season and all that. So. Pelicamp, yeah, that's where we are, Pelicamp. Uh, best places to camp in a minivan, places to sleep at night. Well, I don't have a, mini a minivan yet, so um, I'll let you know, but... Um, the average campers maybe... The, 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 the average campers are, are, are building an NV200 uh, Nissan uh, camper van. Mr. Roboto driving to Key West into the sunset. That's true, that's a good drive, and the best, some of the best sunsets... Outside of Arizona, you can be seen at the Key West, at the key, at the Keys. I mean, Barbev, uh, one of our Florida Keys friends said, "Northern friends, your weather is drunk in my yard. Please come Don't get." get <laughs> are, are you drunk, uh, Barb? Well, I didn't understand the question. No, it's a, it's a meme on Facebook. Oh, it's like Northerners, your your weather is here and he's drunk and he's in my yard. Can you come get him? Oh, okay. <laughs> Take him away. <laughs> I I, don't, I didn't get it, but. Uh, I'll, I'll come and get it, Barb. <laughs> Enjoy down there from Sean, Sean Wooten, Newton. In Tennessee, it would have to be Big Orange Pelican, or of course, he would have his dabber down. Uh, 22 and snow flurries in Brooklyn. In Brooklyn, 22 and snow flurries. Mm, good times. Marjorie Hewitt, I'll be at the Captain's Hideaway on February 9th for two weeks. Sorry, I'm going to miss you. I have a bottle of honey from our uh, prairies for you, from uh, Ap Apiaris, Apiaris, Apiaris for you, so, Apiaris, is that, is that where they make honey? I think so. Okay, there you go, <laughs> it's a beekeeper. Yeah, it's a beekeeper, Apiaris. Oh. Uh, Lorraine Cole, longtime fans, I like your videos. How big is Pelican? Pelicans? There are not as many pelicans here as, as you would think. If you if you drive down to Steinhatchi, you see a little more. Pelican is only an acre. I, I wish it was a little larger because our neighbors on the sides are kind of close. That's uh, that was a design flaw on my part, but we'll fix it with some heavy vegetation someday. Uh, what time is the launch of the spacecraft? Do you know, uh, Rob? Uh, what are your plans in April? April, uh, March, and Mar March, we're probably going to stay in, in Miami. And uh, April, sometime in April, is going to be the beginning of that Lewis and Clark trip, which we're going to linger in the east for a little bit. We're going to Monticello, uh, where Je you know Jefferson's uh, second home there. We're going to do a little bit of... Uh, uh, DC, and then we're working our way west, you know, Harpers Ferry, uh, eventually uh, Louisville, St. Louis, Kansas City, 
and beyond. 611 is the launch. So that's like we're not gonna see it from here. It's 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 totally totally cloudy, like overcast. So um, Steven San Filippo, I'm in Central New Jersey or Jersey. Can I can't wait for snow, but glad not on the coast uh, where they might have a blizzard. Yeah, I heard. And uh, Marjorie Hewitt, I do, and for Trish and Rob too. So, Aww. which I have to I have to pass by there and uh, give them something too. Who's going to win the Super Bowl? I have no idea. The Patriots. Okay, the Patriots. No, they're out. No, they're I'm kidding. They're not in it. <laughs> I don't even know who's playing. I, don't <laughs> I, don't, I, I haven't followed football for a while, believe it or not. Uh, CLT says the launch is live now. Love your desert rain. Can you play it on the guitar? Not really. I mean, and I, I don't have a, I have a guitar that I don't really know how to play because I, I usually play a classical guitar and this one is an is a acoustic. Uh, steel strings. I never learned how to play steel strings, but I mean, I'm, I might one of these days. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I I I learned with nylon strings, which are like the the classical, you know, Spanish guitar, like flamenco guitar, that kind of thing. And uh, yeah, it's uh, Sarah Rodriguez. Thank you for that super Ooh. chat. Hi, Robert. Joined late the chat. What are you drinking today? Well, we started with Big Nose IPA from uh, Gainesville. And now we have High Ally from Tampa. And who, who knows next? Uh, thank you for reminding me because my throat was getting a little dry. So. What you got in the cooler? There's some Goose Island in there, I think. And there, in, inside, there's more, uh, there's more Big Nose so no, yeah, good. Uh, I mean, I still have plenty here, but if you if you want to grab a Goose Island, more than welcome. Yeah, and uh, yeah, that's cool. And right by the handle is there's a bottle opener, so if you want. Yeah. So. Baby, what was the story about playing High Life in Dania or Miami? They stopped. Yeah, yeah, they just. That that's uh, our true cooler there, courtesy of our friends. It's right at the in the, at the center of uh, right where the handle is. There's one on each side. <laughs> do, do, do I need to read the instructions. Hold on. <laughs> you see it? Oh, I, yeah, I yeah. <laughs> yeah. There's a bottle opener right there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I didn't mean to. Uh, here we go. Hello, Robert from Lakeland. Uh, Lakeland. We were near Lakeland recently. We, we went to Zephyr Hills looking for where they get the water, uh, and um, and it was closed. Aww. It's some spring there, Crystal Spring or whatnot. Cheers. Cheers. Mm, cheers. <laughs> Life. Yeah. Greetings, Robert, from New Albany, Indiana. Oh, it gets really cold in Indiana, too. Michelle K. Oh, Dylan Reynolds is asking Michelle K. Never mind. Uh, we are expecting two to four inches. Whoever wanted snow, you can have ours. <laughs> Any idea when you come back through Charlotte, North Carolina? Um, we might go by Charlotte, North Carolina... Uh, on our way to to the Monticello area, which is near the, it's near um, Shenandoah National Park, actually. Charlottesville. It's near Charlottesville. Yeah, but Charlotte, North Carolina. We're thinking instead of going I up I ninety five, which is a tedious drive. Eighty one. Yeah, we might take eighty one. Yeah. And then sixty eight across. Yeah, so that's probably the plan. So it, there's a good chance that it's sometime in mid April will be. Or early April, we'll be in Charlotte, North Carolina, Jero Ger Map. Thank you for that super Woo! chat. Thank you so much. I'm sure glad you're like IPAs. Too happy for me. Happy, no, happy. No, how do you put it? But come to Central Washington and uh, I can show you numerous microbreweries that do lots of IPAs. Well, 
Central. We're going to be in Central Oregon at some point in Bend, which which I hear has, uh, or is it? It's it Portland that has more IPAs per cap, more breweries per capita than uh, any other city in the United States. But bunch of drunks over there. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> Yes, yes. Beer connoisseurs, there you go. That's the that's what that's the word I was looking for. <laughs> but uh, no, in all seriousness, yeah, I would love to. Uh, in Central Washington, I'm, we might do that too because we we we're, we're gonna de definitely do Southern Washington because we're gonna do the hug the Columbia River as part of the end of the Lewis and Clark um, a trip. But uh, we're, we're definitely open. The look at that dog. What did she find a, a water bottle? Jesus. She's cleaning. Yeah, pollution. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm, I get too distracted here at Pelican when I'm doing these live streams. Uh, <laughs> uh, Linda and Gary D., uh, what brand of rocking chair are uh, you using there? It looks really comfortable. It is. It is. Uh, it's called a GCI Outdoor Freestyle Rocker. And I swear for the first time in Quartzsite back in 2018, uh, is, uh, I, I visited the campsite that, um, what was it, uh, the motorhome experiment. They're, they're not doing videos anymore about uh, RVing, but they did for a while. And I visited, I, 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 actually, I actually crashed their live stream <laughs> back then. And, uh, and they had one of these, and I'm like, oh, I'm writing this down. This is like very nice. <clears throat> And Johnny Kite Bartolo, thank you for that super chat. Thank you. Uh, John Mason Smith, I watched your visit from a couple of years ago to Amelia Island. You missed the entire Cuban Revolution connection. Come back and I'll be your guide to the history of this place. You know, I just stay there as Forts. What was it? I can never remember the name of this fort. Uh, oh, the fort there at the, at the state park. Right on the border with Georgia, and uh, I only had like one day. I know I, I wanted to see it for the. Kate, come over here. Don't don't swallow that thing. She threw it to the trash. Yeah, take it to the trash. I don't know. Hey, Francisco Ruiz, hola amigo, aka friend from Oxnard, California. Oxnard, yeah, that's uh, right before Santa Barbara, right? Right near Ventura, right next near Ventura, yeah, that's right. Yeah, near Ventura. I've driven through there. I've never actually. Which a fun fact in the in the movie Sideways, going back to our, our movie for white connoisseurs. Oh, Kate, come here. Come, come here. Come here. Say hello. Say hello to our friends. Hold on. Look at look at look at look at here. Kate, come over. Hey, don't go. Look at the camera. Look at the, say hello. Say hello to our, our friends. Online. Yeah. Okay, okay, no? okay, go to Apple. Yeah. Uh, I see you are at Pelican from John Walsh. Uh, you are going in the wrong direction. You need to go south with this freeze coming. Nah, we're fine here. We're going to be good. Uh, ask Remy. Okay, I'm in Naples. Maybe I'll see it. You mean the... the Focus, rubber, focus, LOL. Yeah, this camera sometimes takes a little bit to, to focus back up. Yeah, that's it. How do we get a zip up TR uh, uh, sweatshirt? I don't, I don't know if these are for sale right now. I have to figure. I, 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 I'm no, I, I've neglected the merch store a little bit lately. Your mask is available. Yeah, my mask is still available, right? Your face. Yeah. <laughs> With my face, huh? I, I thought I never made that available like to the public. It came out. I, I, I made a one 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 off for myself. I was gonna go to the Tampa RV show and the masks were required. It was a mask of my big smile, oh, that's awesome. but it came out too big, so I do look like a donkey. It's like, it's like this big, <laughs> <laughs> so I never wore it. It, it, it was too creepy. <laughs> that would have been great. <laughs> Uh, Mark Drennan, when you come through Louisville, Kentucky, let me know. Uh, I'd uh, love to meet you. I'd love to meet you too. And we're going to spend some time in Louisville. First of all, our, our I, I love the town. My cousin Juan lives there. So we're probably going to spend at least uh, 
a couple of days. We should do a Louisville meetup for sure uh, when we go there. So let's plan for that. Denise Baptista, what an adorable dog. Yeah, she's great. She's great. You know, that, 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 for the first time I came here, uh, she, she stood outside the property. And I was inside the the, 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 the RV, you know, I was here waiting. She's looking at me. She knows I'm talking about her. Uh, yep. I was here inside the RV. And I'm like, you know, I, I've heard about pit bulls that they could be like, you know, sometimes when they don't know you, you know, and all this and that. So I was very careful and cautious and but then you know we, we, we became friends you know and i think she likes being here more than more than at her place uh, is there more information about a meetup at pelican there's no meetups at pelican planned right now but there might be a pelican fest in the future uh, yolanda uh, moreland moreland yolanda moreland thank you for the super chat the super sticker actually it's a, it's a character saying ha, 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 ha. thank you thank you thank you and happy friday joe camacho from texas Yon uh, uh, dave speaking of sideways <laughs> it's uh, worth getting the dvd for the commentary track paul Giamatti and uh, thomas hayden church are hilarious what's a dvd I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm going to see. I, actually, I might have that DVD. Movie night at Telecam. No, you know why? Because I used to I used to rent them for Netflix, from Netflix. Actually, I'm going to put like a big screen here on the side of the, of the rig and maybe project movies at night. I have to bring my projector from Miami or get another one. So, yeah. We could have movie night at Pelican. Thanks for the cameo in your latest video. Delightful surprise to run into you on the road at Kingsville Bridge State Park. Susan and Stefan. Yeah, of course. Yes. Of course, we met first at the... Was it the Cleveland meetup? It may have been. Uh, one, yeah, and then, and then we ran into you guys at the parking lot. There, You know, it's uh, serendipity. Serendipity. Ask Remy says, Louisville is a nice area. Yeah, yeah, I like Louisville. SpaceX, a SpaceX launch is scrubbed. You heard it here first. Yeah. Newsflash, newsflash. Uh, I can't, I can't, I can't help myself. We have to do the. It was gonna be the 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 the, the fire rain cam, but now it's the Kate cam. Katie cam. Hola, Robert. Un saludo para usted, su esposa, desde Norte de Georgia. Saludos en Ruta USA. Thank you so much. Uh, survival. I can't compete with that. <laughs> Traveling, Robert. So if you are going to visit Bend, come north to Yakima. I've heard that place, too. Uh, there are some similarities between the two cities and some differences. Fiesta in Pelican would be a good uh, idea, Robert. I think so, too. Yeah, we, we can do a, there's a balloon fiesta in New Mexico. We have the Pelican Fiesta. We should get ourselves a, 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 a Pelican, uh, like, mascot, like a pet. <laughs> and a smoker. Yeah. And a smoker. My 15-year-old daughter got a CD for her birthday from one of her friends, and we don't have a CD player to play it on. <laughs> LOL. Do they still sell? I'm sure they still sell CD players. In fact, if you get an older computer, it probably still has one of those slots. So, uh, yeah, CD, I, if, come to think of it, right now, here at Pelicamp, if you give me a CD or a DVD or a Blu-ray, I have no... No, wait a minute, Minitini has a CD player, never mind. But my truck doesn't have one. So... Only at Pelicamp. All your NASA news live here. Pelipop looks so happy. Yeah, she looks. She, look at that. Pelipop. That, that's a new name right there. <laughs> that, that's, a, that's a new nickname. Jim Foster is back. You can continue the show now. You started uh, to snow here. Yuck. Snow, no, no, snow is pretty the first time it, 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 you know, it falls, but then it becomes all nasty, right? And then after a couple of days, it doesn't it doesn't melt. It becomes ice and it's nasty, all full of mud and stuff. Yeah, 
Uh, when do you start your Lewis and Clark leg? I'm thinking sometime in April. I wanted to do it early April, see if we could catch the, the cherry blossoms in, in Washington, D.C. But those are so hard to time. I mean, worse than the, than the fall colors in Vermont, if that's the thing. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, my hubby and I were really hoping to meet you at the RV show, but didn't come across you. Some of, someday, you're truly an inspiration. Oh, thank you. Thank you. And, uh, yeah, one of these days we'll, 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 um, <laughs> breaking the camera. Uh, Hi, Robert. Happy Friday. Hobby, Hobby and I having pizza and beer watching you. Oh, pizza would be nice now. But I got a beer. I got a text message here. Let's see who it is. Who is interrupting my... Oh, that's uh, Mr. CLT. Pelican Ranch. Pelican Head Ranch for Telesee. That's good. That'll be good, yeah. Pelican Head Ranch. And brewery. Yeah, why not? And, and, and vineyards. Might as well make it all the way. You know, winery, brewery. <laughs> and and oh, in, in Tennessee, has to, in Tennessee has to be a distillery. It's distillery, you're right. Of course, we have to make that bootleg moonshine. Uh, uh, Bottle Shock is a great wine movie. I have it on DVD. I think I've seen that one, too. It's another one, Bottle Shock is another one that the, the California winemakers went to France and won the, the contest or something like that. So the California wine was actually better than the French wine. It happened like in 1970 something. No, it's the movie. It's a movie called Bottle I think Bottle Shock is that. Oh, I've heard this story. Yeah, it happened. Yeah. And that's when the California wine really took off, like Napa Valley and Sonoma and all the rest. Uh, your shows are up on the TV. Cool. Mine doesn't. Uh, Lucky Dog Production Moderator. Hold on. What? Your shows in... I don't understand. <laughs> Anyhow. Maybe, maybe that second IPA wasn't such a good idea. Uh, Get him another one. <laughs> later, later. I have to pace myself here. Hey. Okay? Uh, Dylan wants to know what's everyone having for dinner tonight. You know, haven't haven't planned that far ahead yet. Probably shrimp. But probably shrimp. Yeah, probably shrimp. Shrimp, it's a good yeah, it's a it's a it's a good bet. Uh, Carol Taverna, hi Robert, I watch you every day at the Tampa RV show, and I must say you are great. You never stopped working. I really enjoyed that you had to show us. Stay safe and happy traveling, Carol. I really enjoyed the Tampa Harvey show, and I didn't work as hard as other people like like these two. They were like all over the place, you know. It's our first time. Yeah, when it is your first time at the yeah. Tampa Harvey show, you tend to overdo it, and it's a good thing. And uh, then we learned by day three, we're just doing live streams. Yeah, exa exactly, exactly. You realize that I'm never gonna have time to edit all this stuff, to edit exactly. all this stuff, and that's what, you know. I have like half an hour worth of video, at least half an hour worth. And one of these days, he was going to release on a Wednesday, like, the rest of the RV show. <laughs> All unedited, you know, like like a half an hour, almost unedited. Yeah. You sort through it yourself, huh? Yeah. <laughs> we were too busy trying to win the smoker. Oh, yeah. You know, that's, that, that, that Margaritaville yeah. thing? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not even the camp stay. We want, we want the smoker. Yeah. <laughs> Quartzite or Tampa RV show, your favorite show? Not Tampa. For sure. RV show, Tampa. Quartzite is more, I mean, the big tent is cool. For the the sheer size of it, and you 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 get to see a, a lot different. It's more about solar uh, uh, and that kind of thing. But Quartzite is more for the community, for the experience, for meeting people, for the experience more than anything else. So um, that's my opinion. As an RV show, you know there are not that many RVs. Most of the RV you know browsing look happens at La Mesa, which is across the street from the show. So uh, no. At, at Tampa, at Quartzite, yeah, no, yeah, but it's it's I don't know, it's mm -hmm, yeah, yeah, but it's it's about Quartzite is about boom talking in the desert, you know, uh, off grid out there, and uh, that's the main appeal, and it's 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 beautiful in its own way, the the the, the, the area. Yeah, yeah. 
Uh, Robert, where are you? We're at Pelicamp, our, our north, uh, I, I would say, eastern uh, Florida Panhandle retreat. What's the IPA tonight from Joe Camacho? Well, we, start, well, we started with Big Nose IPA from Gainesville, and, uh, and we're ending with, uh, well, ending is a strong word. We're continuing with the, uh, High Alive from Tampa. We might end with, with uh, Goose Island. Where's Goose Island from? You have one there. You can... <laughs> Yeah. Uh, can you invite the ad adorable Pitbull Lab to all your live chats? If, whenever I'm here, I'm, she, she always comes by to say hello, and then she gets bored. I don't know, she's still there. Yeah. I give her attention, it's my fault. Yeah. 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 yeah, sometimes she gets bored and, and goes somewhere else. Hey, the average campers, hello, y'all, average campers. Hey. I have to stop by to give Trish what I have to give Trish. Uh, a new puppy. Uh, Barb F uh, wants to know if Apple, did you and Rob get to see the New Horizon at the RV show? Jim is Jim is a New Horizon fan. Oh, oh yeah. you did comment about something. Yeah, New Horizon. They 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 this the very nice fifth wheels. One of them even has a split a mini split unit on it. So oh, yeah, they're yeah, very. No. They were in, 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 in West Midway, uh, which is the one not by the lake, the next one going north south. It's, yeah, the, Tampa, the Tampa show is, is it's, it's huge, it's crazy. It's, uh, it, I was so bummed we missed Quartzsite this year, but uh, installs had us going up the opposite direction. Cross country RV tech and solar, and uh, you know, next year for sure, I want to do quartz. And I want to get there early because I usually do the Tampa show and then I make that mad dash. You know, I don't know how many miles it is, it takes five days. I mean, not towing, you might be able to do it in four, but it takes five days pretty much non stop. So, uh, uh, 6 08 p.m. I think it is time to, to start uh, wrapping this up, everybody. By the way, how do you like my colorful lights back there? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have it. We're gonna have a party tonight. Let's celebrate. <laughs> Let's it's all right. With Katie. Katie Perry. Should I sing? Baby, you're a fine. No, we're gonna get a copyright strike. <laughs> no. I like to call it Katy Perry because Katie, Katie Perry. because perro is dog in Spanish, so Katie Perry, Katy yeah. Perry. Right. <laughs> there you go. Shall we? Shall we finish it with a tropical theme? There you go, everybody. As always, there it is, Rob. <laughs> it's like a party at Polycamp. Uh, there's a, there's a Apple and Katy Perry, and here's Steve. <laughs> Coming to you live from Polycamp in the Eastern Florida Panhandle. Thank you, everybody, and see you next time. Happy Friday. Have a great weekend. Thank you.